Hello everyone, I am Rahul and this is my YouTube channel. Today we are talking about the new movie review, The Expendable 4. Had a simple enough concept, gather a bunch of 80s era action bring them together for an old school style. Shoot them up in which they are along with such current familiar faces and Expendable 4 is just an embarrassment from start to finish and only positive thing to say about it that is should pretty much put a nail in the coffin of a series that has cleared overstay its welcome at least for one another decade. The beginning of Expendable 4, the fourth entry in the action series, the Expendable there is almost a light echo of first blood when we meet back up with the now 37 year old Stallone as Ben. Repetitive snakeness aside, he may be as well the rabbo in his later years as he is dealing with the pain alone and feeling the pain of a lifetime of injuries catch up with him. Will it just now wear near the depth, emotion or complexity, it is still about an action hero who is seeing the world pass by him. The story which both matters not at all and for too much kick off with a group of buddies stealing a nuclear weapons. The film is to put it the plenty as his devil is story. Shortly made even before the mission, there are the several moments where it feels like many of the characters might not even be in the same room together. The occasional moment of machine gun motorcycle, joysting assigned, it is a largely dull and dearly experience that never feels like it's a ever anything more than a hello mimicry of fire battle. Action work of the past rating. This movie is a D rating. Expendable 4 is the worst and the action series yes. The film suffers from poor production quality with destruction effect that feel more like a mobile game. Tony Jane's performance stands out the most entertaining aspect of the movie, overshadowing the otherwise uninspired action sequence. Expendable 4 is in theatre starting September 22. So thank you so much and please subscribe my YouTube channel.